Hi, Adriano. Uh, first of all, tell me about winning the BAFTA and ASC awards for your work on The Crown. Uh, what, it's, I know it sounds like a cliche, but it's honestly like a dream coming true. Yeah. I mean, the ASC was amazing, and I, I somehow, I mean, of course, the whole season one was unbelievable. I mean, I myself on my field, I got nominated for all the most prestigious awards, but I didn't win. And then the fifth one, the, the ASC, that I think, from, I mean, my colleagues and myself, we do consider that a very special award. So I was like over the moon after, you know, you know, you get the nominations, you go to the awards and you don't win. And then, but the fact that, you know, that one was saved to me in a sense, it made, I mean, it really paid the, you know, for the entire season. I really felt super proud and honored. And, and then the BAFTAs, which is, I think makes me even more proud, is that I got these two amazing awards with two different episodes. Okay. So it's actually not the same episode being awarded twice. So it's actually one from season one, another one from season two. So, I mean, it's this show has been honestly a, a game changer for all of us. I mean, the attention and, you know, the, the recognition we've, we, we've got so far it's uh, yeah it's really special it's really special and it's an amazing team we're all we're all going together coming together again for season three uh, apparently I mean it, there's something there's a specific energy on not only one what you see but like you know the thing it's a very good show to be uh, part of you know as a as a creative force or a creative uh, yeah it's, member in a sense yeah and the fact that I've, I've I was there from the very very beginning it feels like especially for me and Martin it feels like we ha we now somehow own the show okay. and then it, it, it but it's uh, f for some reason doesn't feel less challenging I mean it's a different period now we're gonna have a different cast so it's not gonna really feel like a sequel so I think that's another good reason to come back to protect the look to develop you know sure. something yeah. that it's should be consistent but also offer some sort of new stamp you know a new a new approach in a sense yeah okay uh, so we're in emmy season right now i'm wondering do you know if you submitted the same episode that you submitted for the baptist the fourth it, it's gonna be that four season yeah. two yes and uh you have to submit just six minutes from them so do you know uh what clip you chose and what about the cinematography in that section uh was important good question i'm not yeah the, the clear text she runs from um, again if you if you've seen the yeah. the episode so she, Margaret is visiting Tony Armstrong Jones studio and then they have they're having this is after the photo shoot actually so they're on the second floor and she's asking about so what is this picture you know who is this girl and and then she sits on a wheelchair he's developing so the less it's way less formal than all the episodes we had seen at, up to that point and then I also choose that I also chose that section because there's a little bit on the second floor then they go downstairs cross the big uh, light box and then you they get to the dark room turn on the red lights so in six minutes there's an interesting variation in color and rhythm and you know close-ups and wide shots so i thought that somehow because you're not allowed to edit so you have to extract six minutes without any additional cuts so you have to you know somehow find six minutes that cover different lighting situations or that offer a, a beautiful close-up or you know an interesting variety so that's what you know was my goal and I, I think I picked a good one yeah all right thanks very much